Gunner, he'll be just fine. Back to the point I was trying to make, John. We did have odds provided by our betting partners, eSportsBets.io. Of course, Nouns are the heavy favorites. 1.21 in comparison to the 4.17 of Alpha. I'd say those odds don't look so great right now, considering how even the matchup is, but never mind. I've completely cursed Alpha. They lose Soul in the mid lane. Husky, the first one to pick up first blood. Yeah, it only took about 8 minutes 40. We've seen a lot of those back and forths. Gunner just playing fantastic, timing his rune usage really well. Alpha probably not expecting just a lucky Invis rune to allow Gunner to slip away. And he's already off to rotate off the back of that kill. Absolutely. Why the hell not? Down to the bot lane they go, Tiger. He'll cop the snowball here from Gunner. And it's going to be a nice, easy pick off, I believe, here against Tiger. He'll very fire up, but it should not be enough. He rises. He tries to get involved now. Mu, he'll be the target, dropping rather low with these brambles being committed. And that's a great trade. Alpha, they'll be more than happy with that. In fact, Sol now rotating over. Lilis, well, he's going to try to run, but there's not really too many places he can go. And he will drop. So a two-for-one trade in the favor of Alpha now down at that bot lane. And again, that's great news for this Radiant team. It's a pretty big loss. Really, he does come back towards his team. Only supports left now. Husky's not really the kill you want with this big smoke committal. Hookshot. Oh, they found the Monkey King. Tiger. Hookshot's right into the tree line and Yamsung gets caught out. He's going to try and force the fight anyway, but he's completely stunned up. And they do take him out. The ward on that cliff just barely giving the vision still Gunner. He's going to try to move in onto the clockwork and Tiger. He will drop as the trade, but that's a fantastic trade for the side of Alpha. Huge value coming out from that smoke. Now it's just not. He does need some help. In fact, now he's the one being hunted. Mu, he'll make his way in. They do at least find the first life, but can they get him a second time? He'll catch up Mu on the Doom. Snowball in. It's going to be back onto Rises. They really want that Wraith, but there's so many heroes around right now. Gunner, he'll go after Monster instead, but a great Terrorize. Widge, going to force them back and maybe just tank the gank for his carry. But there is a mech up. He'll heal up and keep trying to survive, but eventually Widge is going to drop. That'll be one. In fact, that was two because the clockwork also dropped. Keep in mind, Doom was committed on Rises, but they do not secure the kill onto the Wraith. So, you, you have a lot more play on Alpha in comparison to how it takes now to start these fights on their own terms. Tiger, nice hook shot. He finds Mu. The Doom, still a tanky boy here trying to get through those cogs, but they've got their Rolling Thunder around. RP, it's going to send him out of the cogs, but they should have enough damage. They'll take him out the first time. Moonlight Shadow's there. They might try to turn here on now. They'll move it onto the Magnus. It is somewhat of a trade for ticking down Monster. In fact, now Tiger, he also gets caught out on the clockwork and will get taken down as well. So a two-for-one trade. A lot of commitment here from Alpha. And well, now with all those spells being committed, now... Of course. They can try to look for force fight. And again, if you catch Rises out here, he has no save. Absolutely not. Lelis, and right into Soul. That'll be the smoke broken. Boundless. Oh, it does not connect onto Monster. Skewer is going to be back the way of C. Yamsen. Hookshot is there as well, but it does not land onto the Monkey King. It's just a complete mess for Alpha. Oh, and they're going to give two away for the price of one. Noun's more than happy with that. Into the mid tier one tower they go, and just a, a very messy idea of what's going on at the moment. That direction of the Rocket Flare coming in kind of gives it away. Nouns, they'll move in, Gunner, he'll get the shards out, Yamson now spots them out, oh that's a terrible position for Alpha, they're just trapped between a rock and a hard place, they'll go for the Rolling Thunder, but it's not gonna matter, they'll lose Monster immediately, Yamson, he'll keep going for Roshan, meanwhile Lelis, he's rolling around with a Rubik's Cube right now, just after Rises, just zone him out, cut Wish off instead, on the Dark Willow, meanwhile Yamson, he is still going after Roshan, Fine though is threatening to go for the hookshot into the steel instead they'll chase down rises onto the wraith king force out the buyback the hookshot in from tiger it's used but it doesn't lead to anything rp i mean it's gonna be out but where's your follow-up it's not gonna be there yamps and he's perfectly fine he'll just keep fighting back rises he's in the middle of all of this he goes down the first life snowball back in somehow this monkey king is not gonna drop rises he's still getting kited in oh. and out they'll force stuff yamson away he finally drops but at what cost at what cost for the side of alpha they are losing everything oh boy. <laughs> two die bags right there really tough for Alpha, I mean, it looks like they have that opportunity to go for it. Get forced up back to the low ground, but moves in. He stuns him up, and that's reincarnation. 
It's gone. Boundless, however, not timed perfectly. Rises, he'll blink out. Roshan is now up. Alpha, they're still thinking about forcing this fight. Keep in mind, Reincarnation's down for 46 and they've lost soul. Oh, that's a big deal. That mid pango has gone. And suddenly, Mu, he's found himself a Magnus. Oh They'll doom him up. This is not the fight they wanted. Alpha, they're still going to try, at least for now. But I just don't know about oh, this. They need to back. They are trying to rush a team fight that just doesn't need to happen. They've caught out the Wraith King Rises. He is gone. Oh, this is terrible for Alpha. That's a free Roshan now for Nouns. And uh, they forced the fight that didn't need to happen. Yeah, they tried to come back in. And it's just the same issue, Mike. The kiting is still happening for Rises. We see the left up. We see the four stabs coming in. They just make this Raid King dance around chasing a target. And they just can't find it. In goes Moo again. The jetpack is going to be there for Tiger. He's going to get hit by a snowball and will go down a gunner. Meanwhile, they even found the Willow Wish. He's going to drop to boot. Just everybody on the side of Alpha getting wiped. And now it's right back into the Roshan pit they go. They don't want any kind They're going to try and move into that Radiant Triangle. There's one sentry around to get a, give a bit of protection over. They do have a gem up on Wish as well. Mu is going to move in. We'll see them eventually. Dark Will has been left and rises. He made the jump in. He wants to try and go after that Doom. Yamsun, he'll get right to work. There's a rolling thunder up, but it's a very messy team fight once again for Alpha. They've got to try and retreat out of this. Rises has already left the building. He does not want the fight. Both supports to go down. In fact, they even found the Magnus. Why the hell not? The one saving grace for Alpha is that you managed to hold on to that RP threat for the high ground hold or even for a tier 2. They're trying to go for the fight. Monster, oh. that's a great skewer back, however. They've got the Monkey King. He does have Aegis up and now the four star back to the low ground. He is saved oh once God. again. They can't kill him. Now the stolen RP right back the way of the clockwork. This is not a good fight whatsoever. Alpha, they are trapped between a rock and a hard place and now the shards rises. He's getting kicked around left, right and center. They've got the Wraith King wherever they want, really. Just surround him. He's got no chance. A nice blink away, though. BKB up, get the hell out of there. Rises, oh, he can't find oh a way back to the God. high ground. They just won't leave him alone. First you kite him, kite him out. Now you just kick him into your team fight. Onto the pango they go. Why not another? Soul's gone. We might need to see some buybacks incoming. Or we might need to see a GG call very, very soon because this game is not getting any easier for the side of Alpha. No, not it's, whatsoever. It's really not going to get any easier from here on out, Mike. This is a football match is what it is. <laughs> I mean, not, not just the kicks. All the four staff plays. The fact that Yamsen can just jump so far and not get punished because of oh. the supports. And one more, it's a road <laughs> look, look at that. He was full HP. <laughs> I mean, what can you do? You Magnus. Great play from Moose, just kind of sensing the presence of the Magnus in the tree line. Rolling Thunder's there, but it's really doing nothing. And now with the Wukong's command out, they just cannot stop the, the pushing coming. Now they'll get it done. Moose still moving forward, finding the oh, Wraith King. No. Now Rises. the kickback, leave him alone. Leave Rises alone, he's had enough. Oh, they kick him back again. Oh, Rises, no. Oh. GG! It, it's just disgusting! Yeah, it, it's a rough game. It's a rough game to be a Raid King here. They draft really well, and they play really well now. Right? Like, the itemization into those double four stabs, the Shard eventually coming out. Lelis and Husky just play a fantastic game. Like, they just allowed their team to kite this Raid King. Like, he had so much farm there. Ryzus was just allowed to build up at the cost of his two other cores, and it just didn't amount to anything usable. It it, it was just so hard. There's so much net worth, but four star, four star, kick, kick. It, what can you do? It happens, Jonathan. We are going to head back to our panel. Let's see what they have to say about this game. Maybe that's something that Alpha's lacking as well, not just in you know individual players, but just having that voice in game. Feels like that's where Dota's has really been heading for the past Soul. few patches. Soul could be in pretty big danger here in this mid lane. He's already committed the wind run to try and get away earlier, and well, he might just be punished. And he does, Gunner. He'll secure first blood, and this is why nobody was confident with this wind ranger pickup. 
Good at action top lane. Monster trying to go after Yamson. A very nice toss back from Wish, allowing them to punish the sniper. So they do find a nice trade across the map. Yeah, it works out pretty well. You're keeping that sniper down. They'll defend the top tier one tower from that exorcism. And sadly for Alpha, they find nothing. Yeah, it, it's a wasted exo. They're not able to push in that top tier one. You do drag now and stuff there, but again, you don't Tiger? really have a good way of jumping. Here. That's a lot of damage out to Tiger. Wish he is going to get at least a toss back up to Husky, but we've seen this before. He does go down, but now Gunner can go right after Monster. It looks like he has the oh. damage as well. That's a lot of damage. It's a massive amount of damage. No TP back for the DP as well on the respawn. Soul? Soul, I'm, I'm not sure about this one. He's going to try. They have the toss up. Gunner's still tanking through it. He might eventually die and does. Looks like he didn't have the backup in the end. Yamsen tried to move in, but just couldn't get anything done. And eventually Soul, he does find his revenge. And the Viper at the same time. All they can do is slowly just heal it up with that living armor and just make it harder and harder for nouns. Lelis being even more annoying with that wind run, just threatening to go for the lift up. Wish now going to jump in, but he's already taken so much damage. Might just go down as the avalanche does fly through him. They do take him out. Mr. Slark has now joined. Stampede is there, however, Lelis, he's going to be fine to back off, but a nice power shot from Sol. Just nipping on the backside of the Rubik does find him, so they find a trade. Not too bad. They Nouns more than happy to just accept the fact that Gunner does not go down in this engagement. Still under vision here from Alpha, though. Oh, Wish. Jumping again. Toss back. It's going to be on to Mu. He'll be okay with that, though. He's a very, very oh. tanky target. Look at the damage. Oh, the blade mail just returning everything back to Rises. That's tough. Tips flying out. And, oh, Tiger. He'll be the second to fall. Bit unfortunate. I mean, your toss back move, I, it was definitely the target no. they wanted. And. Boy, do they pay for it. Oh, they pay a lot. Flame TP's coming in. Soul is showing on the wave at the moment. Invisibility. Be there. Instead, however, they're going to find the tiny. So Wish does get caught out there by Lelis. And a bit of damage being pumped out. Stampede is being committed. Wish eventually will drop. They'd love to find Soul as well, but he's going to win run away. Just a, a quick tiny kill here. Going to once again take the kill on the Viper. They are around the Roshan pit, but they don't really have the draft to try and go after the Roshan quite yet, I don't believe. Instead, they're going to infiltrate that Radiant Triangle where they do stick around, and that'll be Monster. Feeling safe in his triangle, but not so much, and maybe now they can force Roshan. It's not the quickest, but as long as you get the right here is tanking Roshan. And now, understanding this, they'll just chip away at the T2 top tower now. You at least have that living armor to make it a little bit slower. Look at the shrapnel damage on the rises. <laughs> Ridiculous. Oh. Jump in again. Wish another toss back. He does find Husky. They do get the kill this time, but it's going to cost his life again, it seems. They do cut in Grease, but it's not going to be enough. Yamson, he just gets right to work. So you find a trade again, but it's a pause 4 for a pause 5. Fine. Use that invis. Yamsun doesn't seem to be done yet, Radiance though. Even through the living tower. armor, he'll just chip tower. away at this TP tower. He's happy to stay out of range of that, that tower and just keep going. Ooh, jump in, move once again. No hesitation. Sensing into the tree line, does move in, and Tiger's gone. But Yamsun, he's a much bigger target. He will lose his first life. Meanwhile, Gunner trying to run. The BKB of Soul allowing him to go for focus fire through the Viper. Now Lelis getting caught out as well. Trying to make a run to the tree line, but eventually he's going to drop. So a successful team fight by Alpha. Off the back of a very nice toss from this Tiny. And the BKB on Soul really... I still feel like you're gunning on Wish to find that opening. Gunning on Soul to get really good use out of the BKB. And that the duration is shrinking here. Jump in, Sol, sees the Sniper, great target from Sol to begin with the BKB, he feels very, very safe to try for this, Stampede away, Yamsun, no, he's not going to get lucky, Gunner, still going to try and chase, does miss out on the stun, but will continue going after that Windrunner, Sol, still just abusing the Windrun to get away, meanwhile Wish, I think it's a bit of a nuisance here on the Tiny, but eventually he's going to get caught out, still a great trade once again for Alpha, they'll find the Sniper as Sol, he goes back in, Gunner, he'll go for a chase. Soul. 
slowed down now by the poison attack, but he's kind of going a bit too far because rises. He sneaks up from the backside, but no, he's been huh? caught out. What? The Invis though with the Shadow Dance, he's going to be okay for now. A great shackle as well from Sol. Lands onto two, still trying for Gunner. The four stuffs again, making it so hard to chase down this Viper. Mu jumping in once again as well. The DP almost finding Gunner, but not quite far enough. Meanwhile, Rises jumping back in. We'll find Mu on the Centaur, and they do take him out. Gunner still playing with fire here, but he may have given, may have given his own life away, and it seems like he has. In comes Yamsom once again. They will find Monster. But it's a successful team fight now for the side of Alpha. And they find that opening once more. They just drag these fights out. Boss is going to be on to Gunner, but there's the backup. Wish already dropping very, very low. Stampede pop Monster. He went for the Exorcism, but Gunner just happily fighting back. Monster forced to back the hell out of there. Ryze is also trying to fight Lelis, but he had a Ghost Scepter. He's fine. Tiger, he will be the one to drop with the tree. And the old Shackle, though, is going to be very, very nice with the Sniper Yamsun. He is going to drop. That's a massive pickup for Alpha. Can they find more? They're going to have to try. Tombstone, a great Shackle once again. They found another two, but the four stuffs coming in clutch, but not quite. Husky does drop. Wish he'll get on the toss back onto Gunner. It's not going to be enough, though. He will go down. Soul trying for a shackle. This time will not land. But Alpha, they should be very happy with this team fight. They'll find a couple of their trouble. That'll be enough for them to get back to farming. They managed to isolate Yamsen out. Four staves weren't there to save him this time around. And Bryce just gets on top of him. It's, it's the power of the Slurk with Ags. He can just gap close from a mile away. Has two opportunities to do so though. They found Sol. This time without a BKB, they know they can deal with the Wind Ranger. And they will. Sol will drop. This is the key. BKB not available, they can go in. But this time, toss back Gunner. He'll just run right back out. He has that haste rune up, so it's kind of hard to lock him down. We will oh keep boy. running, but move. He gets a great stun off. That's going to be the tiny, surely going down. Meanwhile, the slug trying to fight back, but with the nose dive, with the disarm, he can't actually fight. Even through the shadow dance, he can do nothing. It, it's a really awkward spot for Alpha. They bought back on Wish. High ground is really open for the taking. And that's all that happening while well, yeah. yeah, now they're onto the tier 4 tower. It's just kind of hard to see them stopping this whatsoever. Alpha does not have the buybacks available. And, well, now they just know it. And they go. One final team fight. They're going to have to try. The DP in trouble. Monster dropping rather low. Still going. Meanwhile, so is Rises. But the damage is just not there. It's just not there. Gunner, he's happy to turn around. Back onto the Ancient. Monster's gone. Alpha, they are trying their absolute best, they are not calling it. Rises is still going, still trying to buy the time, but it's not enough. The Ancient's way, way, way too low. And that'll be a GG is called. They have seen enough. You know, you've got to give props to Alpha, John. They put up a decent team fight here against the side of Nouns, but all...